Here are 10 makeup tips I wish I knew earlier. Use an illuminator if you want that glowing from within look. This adds so much dimension to your face and if you're taking photos and there's flash involved, game changer. Use your brow gel before you do your base so that you don't get any foundation or concealer in it and end up with product buildup. If you place your concealer in the right places, it can really lift your eye and act as a base for your eyeliner or your eyeshadow. Also, if you do your concealer first and then do your contour and your cream blush, it gives it a little bit of extra time to dry down, which will give you a little bit more coverage. Who can say no to that? Before you set your face, go back in with your concealer brush and just re-blend out those creases if you really want that flawless under eye. Otherwise, you're just going to end up setting the creases and we're not trying to do that. Use a cool toned contour if you want something more sculpting, more... You gotta go. Or something more warm toned if you want more of a bronzy, sun kissed look. I'm trying to look. I look just here. So, you already know. If you wanna bring a little bit more dew back after you've applied your powder blush, go back in with a cream blush and watch the magic happen. If your brows are low key giving Sharpie, go back in with whatever's left on your concealer brush and just buff them out. Oh my god! See the difference already? Sharpie. Snatched. The sharper your lip liner, the more precision you're gonna get. So make sure you sharpen that lip liner up. If you wanna be dewy but not oily, cover your T-zone area and spray the sides of your face. Thank me later. Tell me why my eyelash curler just cut off some of my lashes. Oh my gosh. Who the fuck is wishing evil eye on me? What the fuck? What did I do, please? Um, whatever. I don't really care. I'm just gonna pretend I don't care. But right now, I'm getting ready for school. It's 6.42. I have to be out 7.4... No, 7.24. Now, you're probably like, girl, why'd you wake up so late? Like, the hell? You barely have time. Well, that's because I forgot to pick out an outfit yesterday. And I had to pick one out this morning. Girl, I have nothing to wear, bro. I literally have nothing to wear. So all this time, I was literally picking out my outfit. And not to mention, I have pre-cal today. Like, today's just not my day, for real. But um, I'm going to try to hurry because I can't miss this bus. My man was supposed to wake me up um, at like 4 this morning. He did. I just didn't want to get up. So, that's my fault. And, like, my eyebrows need a trim. I'm low-key repeating an outfit. Today's just not my day. Like, seriously. So, if my makeup turns out bad, too, I might actually just, like, end it all. Oh, but somebody had asked me to, like, make one of those videos. It's, like, um, things you hate or something. I forgot to cream bronze my face. But here's some things that I hate, okay? First off, I hate when my man does not listen to me. Like, I'm telling you to twerk and you're not like just so you hate me jk but i really don't like like friends that are like sneak dissing you but um i also hate pre-cal i also hate like friends that constantly like compare themselves to you and like um like always trying to make you seem like you're a competition i also hate people that create new accounts just to hate like you're a loser. Um, another thing I hate is the overuse of bop. Like, like you can go to the prettiest girl ever, and all you would see in her comments, bop. Oh my god, like she's a bop. Da da da. And the girl could literally sit there and do nothing. Like, what the flip? Another thing I hate is like secret ass haters. Like, I had this one mutual that I was mutuals with, and. She was going around telling everybody, I did this, I did this, bitch. And I never follow people first. This video is low-key making me mad, but, like, I'm having fun. Okay, another thing I also hate is when people try to downplay you for wearing makeup. Like, just like, oh, I can never wear a full face to school. Da, da, da. I don't care. Okay, go to part two. Bye. Let's get ready for school. It's Monday, finally. Well, why? no, not finally. Do I want to be here? No. Do I want to go to school? No. It's currently 6.41. I have to leave the house at 7. I don't know why I've been waking up so late. I woke up at 5.30. And I went back to sleep. And then I woke up at 6. And I went back to sleep. And my mom woke me up at 6.30. Okay, I don't even know what I'm going to do with my hair. What the actual fuck? I broke a nail. What the fuck? I didn't even notice I was opening like the little thing. That's crazy. Oh, what the hell? 
Oh my god, that just ruined my goddamn day. Like, so I'm going to stop yapping and actually get ready because I have literally like 10 minutes to do my makeup. I'm going to look for the now when I come home so I can glue it back on. It probably felt like during my sleep. I probably was trying to fight someone in my sleep and my mind broke. I set my face before and after my makeup so it can last longer. I'm going to try to do a makeup really fast because it's 6.46. And I have to be done with my makeup by 6.50. Shit, no. By 6.55. And then I'm just gonna, like, give myself five minutes for my fucking hair. And, and yeah. I'm gonna be back when I'm done with my makeup. I'm done with my makeup. Now we're gonna do my hair. And it's 7.03. Lashes are not lashing today. But it's whatever. Oh my god. Oh my god, I have to do that. I'm keeping my natural hair today. Do you order it, huh? Oh, too deep for today.